Howdy! Welcome to the first in our series of knots with seven crossings. That's right, seven! As we study knots with ever greater complexity, we'll find that there are exponentially more ways to tie them. Hopefully that's an intuitive fact. To kick things off, we're starting with what might be the most blatantly symmetric of the bunch, the 7-1 knot. It basically amounts to a seven-pointed star. Let's tie in. We begin with the simplest knot of all, the overhand or 3-1 knot. As you might recall, we can simply add another wrap to get to the 5-1 knot. We're actually going to wrap another time to land on our 7-1 knot. As you might have guessed by now, there's an entire series of knots with odd numbers of crossings that are tied this way. As usual, we'll bring the knot into standard form by connecting the ends. And now we can dress the knot for inspection. A little practical tip here. As we start adding more and more crossings into the knots, the fibers of our strings can build up a little bit of torsion, which can make it hard to lay the knot flat. If you run into this trouble, simply untie and shake out the cord. Let the cord settle before starting to tie again. Look at that! A seven-pointed star. And pretty easy, too. Next time, we'll investigate another familiar construction, the 7-2 twist knot.